Hi friends, it's your EC Dehub coach Kayla. Today we're going to make a game. We're going to make a bug rescue game. Check out what we need to make our activity. For a bug rescue activity, the materials you need are ribbon or string, tape, scissors, some paper, and a box or another type of bowl or something like similar to that. All right, the first thing you need to do is make bugs. If you have plastic toy bugs or plastic spider rings, you can skip this step and it can make it more fun. But if not, you can draw your own bugs here, like I will. First, I'm going to draw a spider. A spider is a circle with eight legs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and I'm going to give him two eyes and a mouth. Next, I'm going to draw a B, an oval body with some wings, some stripes, and a face. You can color them in after if you'd like. Then I'm going to draw a butterfly. And hmm, what's another bug I can draw? A worm. And I can draw a fly. And I'm going, those are the only bugs I'm going to draw today. You can draw as many bugs as you would like for this activity. And then after you draw them, you need to cut them out. These are what my bugs look like once they're cut out. Before I put them in my box, I'm going to rip up some old extra scrap paper to hide them in the box. There's no special way to rip your paper. You can rip them in strips or however you want. I'm going to rip mine in strips and then make them smaller. Like this. You can make a different types of rips, big, small, whatever you want. You're going to take your scrap paper and fill your box with it all around. If you don't want to use paper, you can use Easter grass or more string, whatever you want, and you can be creative. And then you can put your bugs in like this. And the last step to set up the game is putting the string or web in. The last step is weaving the web. You're going to take your ribbon and tape it onto the box on any spot of the box. Keep the ribbon or string attached to the spool so you can have as much ribbon as you need. And you're going to weave it around the box over and over until you get a web you created that you like. Make different patterns. I want to completely cover the box. When you're ready to end your web, you can cut your ribbon and tape it to the box so it's nice and tight. And then you're ready to play your game. Spread out your paper and your bugs in the box. Take turns using scissors to cut a string and see if you can find a bug underneath it. You can use your fingers or if you have tweezers, you can use that for a challenge. I found a bumblebee. It's your turn. What can you find? Hi friends. Thanks for making that bug game with me. I hope you have lots of fun. Have a wonderful day. Bye.